Hey guys, Ben here, and welcome back to another video on The Flash Season 5. Today we're going to be talking about the new Godspeed photos that have just been released, so we're going to be talking about it. This is episode 18 of Season 5, so we're getting quite close to the end of the season, but this is my most anticipated episode, I think, of the entire season. Obviously, probably bar the finale, because that's how we wrap the season, but we don't know what's happening in that yet. So, if you do go on to enjoy the video, please be sure to leave a like and a comment, and subscribe if you're new, so you don't miss any DCTV videos later this year. Okay, so this episode is titled Godspeed. Lots of people are still commenting on videos on Twitter, and just generally online, saying, Oh, I'm not sure if Godspeed's going to appear in this episode, maybe it's just the title, and they fabricated those photos from the set. That's bullshit. Godspeed's 100% coming. For some reason they haven't like even premiered a look at Godspeed apart from the leaks which I know they all know about the people behind the scenes who run the Flash. They definitely know about the leaks that have been circulating the internet for ages, for months. So they know about that but they've chosen not to actually promote this episode including Godspeed and we'll see if they do that in these photos but we are expecting probably one more trailer before its return before The Flash's return on April 16th, so currently it's April 11th, so we've got five days to go. I'm kind of doubting whether we're going to get that last trailer or not, but it's been a while. I'm really excited to have The Flash return with this massively anticipated episode. Alright, so let's break down these photos. They were just released yesterday, and obviously we'll go over the synopsis just after, maybe at points where we need to sort of recontextualize what's happening in these photos. Alright, so the first photo of the lot is a massive reveal, and I'm very shocked they actually revealed this confrontation, but we get to see Eobard Thorne in his prison cell in 2049, and Barry is there. Holy shit. Face to face for the first time, Eobard's looking very smug, and Barry is just facing deadpan into his eyes, being like, what the hell? Why have you been working with Nora? And I think this is a crucial scene in the episode of how Barry is going to continue talking with Nora and not just completely disregard Nora because I think Thorne is going to explain why she's been working with him because right now we've got no concrete information as to how she initially met him and as to how, you know, they became acquaintances of sorts. And this photo is just absolutely amazing. When I first saw it, I was just sort of gasping, like, oh my god, I can't wait for this scene. Alright, so let's move on to the next shot. We see Eobard Thorne, he's in his prison cell. And like I mentioned before, the lighting in the background is yellow. And if you've noticed over the past episodes, his lighting has slowly gone from yellow and now it's at red, meaning probably in correlation with the timer that's going off because we know that's ticking down he doesn't have long we don't know what that time is supposed to be for whether it's you know death row he's actually going to die or it's something else but it's yellow so it seems like maybe Nora has gone actually back in time but obviously to the future but back in time for reverse flash so that it's yellow or maybe they've saved him from this timer I'm not sure but I'm looking forward to seeing the explanation. But this is most definitely the same scene where Barry is confronting Thorne, so I just can't wait for that confrontation. Alright, so next photo is quite mysterious. So we have this man, I have no idea who he is, but he's in some sort of armour, some sort of suit, and he seems to be an acquaintance with Jessica Parker Kennedy's Nora. But this is not the Nora we know. She's got the ponytail down the side, she's got the gauntlet, she doesn't have a suit, she's wearing a hoodie. So this is definitely Nora from the past and we've seen this in set photos and we know this version of Nora is going to be fighting Godspeed. We know that for a fact. So is this guy next to her a speedster or someone that works with her and Leah because we know Leah is a speedster that's coming into this episode and she is going to in fact be killed by Godspeed. So is this sort of a bit what like they had in the comics with the newer run when they had all the new speedsters after the speed force storm they all grouped together and then at one point godspeed starts picking them off one by one and maybe this guy's a speedster as well and they have a whole faction of speedsters 
that are actually killed off one by one by Godspeed and maybe this is what's happening here. This is obviously just my theory, I could be completely wrong, but I think that's a cool idea if they were to bring that over from the comics. So yeah, definitely a older version of Nora, that being in the past, and so she doesn't have her full on suit at this point. Alright, so we get this photo and this is of Danielle directing the episode, so I'm super excited for her because there's a good track record in the past of the actors coming along and directing episodes, including Tom Kavanagh. He did an episode back in season four, or maybe his first one was in season three. You could correct me if I'm wrong, but he definitely did one in season four. And then in season five for the hundredth episode, he directed it. And so there's a really good track record with actors coming into it. And I think in terms of TV and in terms of The Flash or any of the DC TV shows, it's a good sign because these actors actually know the characters and they focus on the moments that they believe they should do and you know they can obviously edit stuff and be like no I don't want this in this episode I think we should insert this to here so they can give input and I think that's good because especially Danielle she's so connected to the show she knows everything that's going on she's a massive fan she's always publicized in the show when a lot of the stars don't do that so I think she's definitely connected and I think that's a good sign because in terms of TV most directors are a bit disconnected because they change obviously most episodes actually so it goes between tons of people unlike a film where the director is the main person controlling the vision so I think for TV it's a good sign that actors are joining in because she's been here the whole time Tom has been here the whole time and there is a strong sense of a connection and I think think that's why a lot of these episodes are actually really good so looking forward to Danielle's episode so much all right so we go on to the next photo and we see Nora as she's down in the cell and we see Iris in the background and she's going to confront her but also not confront her it seems like in this episode she's going to be more trusting of Nora she's going to sort of listen to Nora more so than Barry and although I think she's totally against it, which I think she is, I think she's just going to be a bit nicer in terms of how she approaches Nora and this massive revelation that happened last episode at the end. So I think Nora's going to try and talk to Iris and Iris is going to try and talk to her. So we see this next photo of Iris again down there next to Nora in the cell and so they're just going to be talking. And we go on to the next photo and oh my god, this is the same sort of scene that we saw earlier with Barry confronting reverse flash but you get to see it from a different angle and you see Barry's reflection looking at himself as if he was like the reverse flash and I just love that it's like the reverse of Barry the reverse of the reverse flash you get it it's all very symbolic and I really love this photo but I just can't wait for this confrontation because, like I said earlier, we're going to get the explanation. But then maybe this teases sort of what's happening with Nora in the future. But maybe this also talks about Godspeed because, again, this is titled Godspeed. Godspeed's going to be a massive part in this episode. But I'm sure Reverse Flash knows about Godspeed, surely. It, especially if it is Nora from the past fighting Godspeed or maybe he is a new addition to the timeline with all these timeline changes so he has no idea and maybe that is the threat. Alright so moving on to the next photo we see Nora in the cell and maybe at this point she's being let out I'm not sure but she seems kind of surprised so maybe it's Barry returning. The next photo shows Nora as she's in the cell she's sitting there on the ground so this is very early on in the episode. And then we go to the future, well, the past for Nora, and she has her ponytail hair on the side, and she's holding a flash ring. So what ring is this? I think this is probably going to be the reverse flash's ring. It could be the flash ring from the Flash Museum, but more likely than not, it's the reverse flash's ring that perhaps she uses reverse flash's suit. I think that would be very interesting, but that's just a theory. All right, so the last few photos are just of Danielle directing, so you can see this one here. And then the next photo after that is directing Nora. So this is actually young Nora in Star Lab. So that's very interesting that they're actually shooting in that specific scene with this young Nora. So maybe in the future, young Nora and the guy that we saw earlier, who I have no idea who he is, maybe their hideout or their 
base of operation is actually in Star Labs, that would be very interesting. And so the last couple of photos is again of Danielle directing Nora and she's wearing her gauntlet and everything like that. And the final photo is of a sort of Western confrontation between Iris and Nora during that same scene that we've seen many times in these photos. So that is about it for this video guys, thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy the video, please be sure to leave a like and a comment, subscribe if you're new, turn on notifications so you don't miss any videos, and I will see you guys later, goodbye.